Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we follow NH Press now as he audits a post office in the most vile way he can imaginable. I mean, I had to cut out a lot from this video just so you people wouldn't smash your computers out of frustration. So let's sit back, relax, and try to keep your equipment intact. What? I can't hear you. I can't hear you. I cannot hear you. There's a reason for everything, yes. What is the reason? What do you mean? Why are you filming? You're not supposed to film postal. It's illegal to film anything postal. I can't hear you with the mask on. You, it's, you're not supposed to um, film anything postal. Well, it's digital, so I'm recording. You're not supposed There's to. There's no film in this. But you're not supposed to. What do you mean? Why? Who it's told you that? Federal. Yeah. You're not supposed to, you're not supposed to record anything. Of course I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. It's on your poster 7. Wrong, 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 you're wrong, you're wrong, you're wrong. Why don't you go take a look at it? Your post for seven, your rules and regulations? You can't, you can't record it. You may not like it, but you're not going to tell me I can't do something I'm legally able to do. So why are you recording? That's my business, ma'am. You can't record here. Of course I can. No, this can't. is federal property, which is right. every right to record here. It's not federal. Yeah, federal exactly. You're not supposed to be recording. Yes, I can. I just informed you that it's on your poster seven. Why don't you go do your due diligence and check it out? Are you the postmaster? Or? You're calling the postmaster? Okay. Just continue working, man. It's that simple. I'm crossing the line. No, the line's right there. You got that? Oh, you can't hear me? Yeah. Can you see? Can you see? Do you see that? Since you can't hear, can you see that? Yeah. I know. Matter of fact, I'll go inside and I'll record. All right, let's go in and look at poster seven and get a stamp. Here's your rules and regulations. Looks pretty old to me. Two thousand three, maybe. Not too sure. Photographs when used advertising on commercial purposes. Maybe taking an entrances, lobbies, foyers, corridors, or auditoriums when used for public meetings. Just like S. Elmo, he hit the right part, but did not continue on. So S. Elmo. Take it away, read it for us, and show us where you both went wrong. Photographs for news purposes may be taken 
in entrances, lobbies, foyers, corridors, or auditoriums when used for public meetings, except where prohibited, okay? It's not pro prohibited here. There are a number of things you glossed over in that. You didn't even complete the whole damn paragraph, and what you did read, you glossed over. The most important part that you did read, but totally ignored, was the part when used for public meetings. And there are no public meetings going on right there. So you don't have the authorization to do that without the installation head, which covers the last half of the paragraph you did not read. I will read the last part of the paragraph for you then. Prohibited by official signs or security force personnel or other authorized personnel or a federal court order or rule, other photographs may be taken only with the permission of the local postmaster or installation head. So you distort and lie about what the poster actually says so you can get away with your vile acts. You, sir, are a scumbag. Yes, I can. It doesn't matter. You can't film in here. Yes, sir. yes, I can, ma'am. Okay, hang on. The memo just went out the other day for you. That post office memo that you are referring to does not give you a car bond to do what you are doing. It does not retract anything on Poster 7. In fact, all it does is give strategies on how to deal with morons like you. You're in a public area. <laughs> I don't care. I don't see how people don't expect privacy in, in a public area. Go home, close the blinds. Oh. Then you should know better. 15 minutes later. Are you the postmaster? I'm sorry? Really? I give what I get, man. Are you the postmaster? Are you the postmaster? Are you the postmaster? Can I have your name, sir? No. Why? Why don't you want to be professional, man? Make your post office look good. Control you people that are in here, will you? Or I will. Yeah, you too. Seriously, what is your major malfunction? Why do you feel the need to treat people like that? Do you have some sort of God complex, you freaking moron? Activity in the lobby may be recorded, monitored, for operational or security purposes. And in a nutshell, that's what it says on poster seven, but you're too much of a freaking dumbass moron to even comprehend that. Oh, bye, Karen. Where do you work so I can come visit you? You work for the government, where can I come visit? I'd love to go. Office full of Karens, I bet. Causing a disturbance. And what kind of freaking bastard are you for chasing that woman out of there like that for? What did she ever do to you? I bet you get along real great with the women the way you seem to be treating them around there right now. Chasing them out the door and talking down to them like that as if they're nothing but a bunch of dogs. You vile creature. Hi, can I get a penny stamp please? Honey stamp? Yes, ma'am. I have another name to you. Say my last name. Anything else? Anything else? No, thank you. 731-85. Peekaboo. Yes, print. You guys don't have name tags, sir? Can I see your name? 
What's your name? I'm going to the survey. Jinder. Jinder. That's okay. beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you. I appreciate it. You too. 15 minutes later. Thank you, sir. I thought a customer called. I'm not sure who called. Well, that's it was on the radio. I heard it. Okay, come on. Come on. Many hours later. What do I got? Ten minutes? Yep, ten minutes. I'll be here till then. Awesome, man. What you tell him? What happened? I mean, Nothing. Come on, it's transparency, man. I, I, I understand man. you're um, expressing your constitutional right to film in public. Okay. And there's nothing. nothing yeah, I mean, as long as I'm not causing a disturbance and going behind the counters, I don't see an issue with what, it. What's your first name on brand? I can't give that information. Okay, cool. I will shake your hand, though. Okay. Um, the, uh, the, the main problem is, isn't really me. It's mm -hmm. the customers that don't understand my rights mm -hmm. or their rights, our rights. And then they get a little uncomfortable and they get, I, I mean, you know I, what just, mean? And, I would feel uncomfortable if someone's walking around filming me, but yeah. it, it's not a yeah. law. And I'm not, and I'm not, you know, picking anybody out in particular, mm -hmm. unless they approach me and talk to me, ask me what I'm doing and so forth. Then I kind of, you know what I mean? Other, unless you're a police officer. Yeah. But I mean, other than that, you know, it's, they kind of get everybody riled up. It takes only one. Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden the whole lobbies, and then all of a sudden they think I'm being disorderly. Mm -hmm. You were being disorderly the whole freaking time. I had to cut out so much of it because I'm strapped for time right now. And because I don't want my subscribers to get pissed off and bust their computers up. I mean, there was only so much of you I could take before I had to take a break from you myself. You are an ass. Not to mention that police officer needs to be educated on what Poster 7 actually says.